Today, uh, as we resume our uh, uh, relations in the most efficient and the most uh, helpful way to both of our countries, I come here with a message that we have to continue on the road for peace. There is nothing that can bring about security, prosperity, and well-being of all of us except peace. They uh, should uh, withdraw uh, their troops from uh, Lebanon and uh, implement uh, in the best way the uh, UN Security Resolution uh, 1559. <laughs> هناك إجراءات غير منطقية وغير واقعية وغير مقبولة نحن خنقنا اقتصاديا كما خنقنا أمنيا في قطاع غزة والضفة الغربية أنا الأوان أن تنتهي هذه الإجراءات الإسرائيلية ونحن والسلطة جاهزة لاتخاذ كل التدابير الأمنية من أجل منع تكرار ما حدث في السابق في منطقة كارني بعد عملية economic lifeblood of Gaza depends on the passage here at Kani at the moment as you can see it's not working it's essential for the future of the Palestinian people and a Palestinian state, and certainly for the stability of Gaza, that uh, this passage begin to work properly. Now, we have done a lot of work with our colleagues in the Palestinian Authority and also with the Israeli authorities, and we are confident that ways can be found to make this passage commercially viable, as well as providing enough protection to Israel so that two, the two objectives can both be met. We do not believe there's any contradiction when it comes to the passage of cargo across the border here.